From our studios at historic Arnold's Park Amusement Park, it's Okaboji Broadcast with Jeff Thee. Come to Pinkerton Park, Pinkerton Park, Pinkerton Park, Welcome to Okaboji Broadcast, everybody. I'm Jeff Thee, coming to you from our studios here at Arnold's Park Amusement Park. You gentlemen know that it also works as a green room for the bands in the summertime. Gary Lambert and uh, Dave Boone here with us here today. Hi, guys. Hey, Jeff. Hey, Jeff. You've spent some time here in the summertime, haven't you, with yeah. the various bands? Yeah, I like what you've done with the place. <laughs> it's good. It's like a lot of lighting. Yeah. <laughs> I'm not much of a decorator. I got a banner, and that's that's the extent of my decorating here. <laughs> yeah, I miss the sandwiches and the free drinks. But. Well, if I'd have known you wanted that, <laughs> I'd, I'd, I'd have something sitting here. <laughs> well, we have a kind of a blowing day here today, but uh, you guys have been up to something here, and whoever wants to take the lead, tell us how we got where we are, but it's called So Much Better Together, something you produced during, uh, what was it, Christmas week, New Year's week? Yeah, the, the holidays. Yep. Okay. Yeah, it, uh, uh, to go back in the story, it, um, this is our first official release on our record label, um, So Much Better Together by Rock All the Cart and Friends. The, how we got to this idea, my daughter Madison and I were watching the Gophers probably lose to the Hawkeyes, <laughs> the Big Ten Network, and this must have been a couple years ago, but we heard this commercial jingle, and it was so catchy, yeah. and I was, I think I told Dave, but I said, we have to add this song to our set list, you know, it's yeah. such a good song. So over the next like two, three years, I'd look for it. I couldn't find the song. I'd search the lyrics and nothing. There's nothing out there on this song. So I come to find out in like October that it's a 20 second commercial jingle. Oh. It's not a song. It's, not, it's, a, it's just yeah. a jingle you would hear. Right. Yeah. So it, Madison yeah. and I said, we need to write this song and finish it. So we kind of put it off. And then in December, we started writing lyrics and Dave helped and my sister, Wendy. And then we um, thought the song is about togetherness and working together unity. Well, let's get some of our musician friends to record it. Nice. So we brought in Adam and Jacob, Final Nights, Triple Shot, 10-7, Rock All Cart, and then um, pretty much everybody who came to our house, if they were coming to see uh, Carter Madison, the kids, or coming over for a bite to eat, we'd have them record on the song. <laughs> There's probably like 50 or 60 people. They'd take off their mask quick and sing the line. It's, and it's what you would call a jam session. I right, mean, you show right. up, you're going to be in on this. Yeah. Thing. yeah. So, so much better together is the song. Lift up a friend. Take care of your fellow man. Always be kind. Lend out a helping hand. It starts with me. And it starts with you too. Side by side, be by be, hand in hand, we will stand. When we come together, my world is so much better. My life feels so much better. I like it, I love it. When we come together, our world is so much better. Our lives feel so much brighter together. And it just came out last week. It's available to stream wherever, wherever you buy music. Um, look up Rock a la Carte, and then uh, we'll get you the link. But yeah, it's just a fun song. It's catchy. It's inspirational, and it's just we want to get out there. Especially, you know, I don't even talk about what's going on, but but we're a lot better when we're together. We, we do need unified. to be together. <laughs> right. Yeah, absolutely. And we've never been more apart than we are right, right. now. It seems, at least in in my years, and yeah. so. So as we were recording the song, this just the conversations because as musicians, all the bands and you know we've all voted for different people sure. and we've all you know but just coming together on the music and there's so much more that we have in common that you know is so much more important and I, we're, we could do we can do so much more if we're all on oh yeah the same page and I think music is a perfect example of that you know when mm -hmm. you hear a song you like you got a group you like whatever it may be. You're not worried about. Well, I wonder who they vote for. Right. <laughs> you know. Right. Yeah. I wonder what their <laughs> their position on this issue is. Yeah. You like a song, and you like that song with a million, two million other people of all different yeah. faiths and beliefs and sexual orientations, yep. and you name it. Just and the way to feel as part. Of, everybody wants to be part of the group. You know. Music to unifier. Yep. Yeah. Exactly. Yeah. Right. It's the same thing when you're playing too. You got a crowd of people. We're looking out there. We don't care if they're. A liberal or a conservative. No. We're all Hawk. here for the same reason. That's right. Hawkeye fan, gopher fan. Yeah. 
and <laughs> well, through Iowa State fan, they're just to really get things wild up here. <laughs> they're just happy to be there. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> but that you know, and it, it um, it's personified by the fact that you brought in a lot of your friends from different groups and so mm -hmm. forth. It wasn't just rock a la carte or Boone and Lambert. It was you know you brought right. in. What a great feeling. Yeah, as the song went along, it's just, this has to be a group project, and what a great way to launch the record label, and, you know, because eventually we want to get, we want to feature Okaboji area artists, so yeah. I've already got some that are going to start releasing songs with us. We have Dave Raleigh and Adam Lehman, and, and then we thought also with the song, uh, we thought it would be a cool way to, you know, community togetherness, and Dave and I had this idea uh, to kind of share share the wealth of the song. So we thought we could partner yeah, with someone. Yeah, so we don't know if it's going to end up making any money or not. But if it does, we didn't feel right taking the profits on that just because it was such a collaboration. Right. So we decided to um, give any profits is going to go to kings and queens of uh, Okaboji here. Yeah, to which I, when you when we were talking about that, I said, which is what? So I mean, exactly right, what is right. kings, kings and queens? Kings local. So... They are a group that's primarily committed to being a support for fostering and adoptive families. Right. So people don't realize how big of a need that is in this area, all areas really, but we have it right here too, and people just don't think about it. So. Now, now, when you say support, uh, what kind of support are for the uh, fam? Is this uh, some kind of... Um uh, physical support or what kind of support are you giving to whether about anything you can think of so okay they they do run Caden's closet which is if you have a foster child or even an adoptive child you can bring your kids in there get them some clothes people donate the materials you go in you just get what you need yeah. so they're they're right there to help you out when you need it it might be they bring a family a meal it might be uh, training for the foster families right just they go above and beyond with just about anything you can think of. They're really, really great. And with that, you know, Dave doesn't like to toot his own horn, but, yeah. you know, it was close to us, especially Dave, because Dave's really been involved with fostering and yeah. adoption and has some cool stories. And so we thought that was special for the musicians and Dave, and it was a good fit with them. Yeah, and this is amazing and just wonderful about this area, the different support systems we have for sure. many things, such as Kings and Queens and so forth. But very giving area. Yeah. And we're very fortunate to be a part of it. We are. Yeah. We are. So what's your label, label again? What's it called? Well, there? it's we're launching uh, Root 86 Records. Okay. We've, we've uh, like 15 years ago, we did some things, but this is the first official release where it'll be available on all platforms. and. Okay. And uh, we've gone through all the re the steps, and it's you know it's a real record label, real real music, and it's out there yeah. for the world. Just just like uh, Iowa Great Lakes recording with John Sam right, like, yeah. decades ago. Yeah, and that's that's part of it too. Um, when I moved here, you know, back in two thousand four or five, John was one of the first pr people that I met, and just to hear his stories, you know, just such a cool guy. But yeah. but meeting him one on one, such a personable guy yep. and a great guy and so it's Route 86 is kind of a tribute to him too keeping the music in the area and the what a nice tribute to a started. wonderful man yeah yeah, yeah. fantastic so again the uh, it's so much better together rock a la carte whether you Apple or iTunes whatever yeah, Spotify, Spotify YouTube Google Dave's TikTok they've got an 8-track yeah TikTok <laughs> Twitch it's out there yeah every iHeartRadio iHeartRadio yeah, very Oka good Boji Broadcast Radio yeah, yeah. Well, <laughs> wonderful well, and, now, and I have to ask you before we go uh, Winter Games Weekend where, yeah. can, where can we find you? we'll be playing um, Friday night we're going to open up for Thunderstruck so we've got a great set um, planned we've got friends joining us for that so it'll be uh, uh, Friday night can, what time do we play? Seven uh, seven thirty. <laughs> we're gonna go back. We'll be the first. Let's band. say early evening. Yeah, yeah. yeah get yeah. there early because we're gonna start with the bang. We're and the then owner. yeah, cool. Saturday Dave and I will be playing at the pavilion. So from like uh, eleven to one, and then three to six if you need to stop in and warm up. And yep. Rick, grab some food from the food trucks outside and jump in at the pavilion. We'll and we'll take in, in some great music while you're at it. That's right. Yeah, yeah. that's what Winter Games is all about. What's well, kind of Okaboji is all about as well. So <laughs> wonderful. Well. Thank you guys for coming in. I really appreciate it. And, oh, yeah, always a pleasure. It. And Gary, I always think it's so funny. I've interviewed about every member of your family except you. I, mean, I was just thinking <laughs> that coming over. Yeah, yeah. 
lot, multiple times. Yeah, yeah. Like, <laughs> one after another. It's like, well, when is Gary going to come in? So yeah. here we are. Gotcha. <laughs> Thanks. Well, good to see you and Dave. Thank you for coming in here today. Thanks, Jeff. Okay. All right. Well, I want to thank Moon and Lambert here for coming in here today, talking about the song again. It's so much better together. Wherever you get your digital music, that's where you can pick it up. And, of course, it goes to the Kings and Queens right here in the Lakes area. We want to thank them for joining us here today. We thank you, as always, for watching us right here on Okaboji Broadcast. so much brighter together, together. Okaboji Broadcast from the studios at Historic Arnold's Park Amusement Park is brought to you by the Scott Troutman State Farm Agency in Spirit Lake, Pure Fishing in Spirit Lake, Last Touch Painting and Cleaning providing interior, exterior, house painting and professional cleaning services in Spirit Lake, Quest Wealth Management, a financial advisory practice of Ameriprise Financial Services, advisor Jan Spielman, AJ Spielman, and Erica Wachholz. Duckies Marine and Motorsports, repair in Spirit Lake. Bank Midwest, dream big, plan wisely, live well. Lakes Regional Healthcare and Avera Partner. Attorney Bethany Brands at Brands Law Office in Spirit Lake. Ruth Van Locker at the Lake, where carnivores are welcome on Hill Avenue in Spirit Lake. Beck Engineering in Spirit Lake. V Radiant Laser Skin Studio in the Okaboji Plaza in Okaboji. The YMCA of the Okabojis is the Bedell Family YMCA, building strong families and strong communities. 